This is John Leak with a brief report on window glazing materials testing. On this test of different glazing putties and compounds and different pretreatments for glazing rabbits, I placed in October of 2005 testing DAP33 permelastic, aqua glaze, and glazol putties with no pretreatment, boiled linseed oil pretreatment. That was ordinary American market boiled linseed oil and alkyd resin oil based primer. So you can see here the results on this sample panel is that there's been some failure where there was no treatment on all of the putties and glazing compounds except aqua glaze and here's another test panel from March of 2007 here I'm uh, testing pretreatments of de-waxed shellac Alkyd resin pretreatment uh, commercial product Penetrol and Alkyd resin oil based primer with DAP33 glazing compound, Sarco Type M, Allback linseed oil putty, Aqua Glaze, and Permelastic. And on the, this test panel, this sample panel, you'll see that there's been. Uh, uh, just a little failure, failure with Allback and DAP33. And on both of these years, along with these sample panels, I tested uh, uh, out on real windows on real buildings. I uh, installed some side-by-side -side comparison field tests. And all of those field tests have shown good performance no matter which pretreatment was used except some slight deterioration where there was no pretreatment. So that's the scoop on testing compatibility of these various materials. My preference and what I usually use right now is on most of my projects is uh, Penetrol or a custom mixed um, linseed oil alkyd resin pretreatment. It's interesting that shellac, the wax shellac that's more water resistant also seems to hold up pretty well although that's not a general practice here in North America. I learned about that from uh, Hans Albeck from over in Sweden. So that's the latest brief update on that side-by-side -side comparison testing.